a bitter Labour Party row has broken out in the middle of Sir Keir Starmer's first party conference as leader, with trade union chief Len McCluskey savaging Sir Keir's meaningless slogans. Sir Keir Starmer's latest leadership slogan has been ruthlessly savaged by trade union chief Len McCluskey. The General Secretary of the Unite Union said that the new slogan a new leadership was meaningless and dull. He went on to warn Sir Keir that the Labour leader will be in trouble if he does not follow a radical Corbyn agenda. Mr McCluskey's warnings came amid Labour's four-day annual party conference, which started on Saturday. In an interview with Sophie Ridge on Sunday, the left-wing trade union chief warned Sir Keir had to listen to the left. Sophie Ridge claimed Sir Keir's new leadership slogan is a bit of a dig at Jeremy Corbyn. Mr. McCluskey laughed, saying, well, it's not got my pulses running. It's a bit meaningless, actually. It is just a statement of fact, isn't it? He also had a dig at the party leader, who was a fervent supporter of a second Brexit referendum last year. The Unite Union boss claimed, Labour lost the election on one issue only, Brexit. Ridge said, you said last month, Keir has to recognize that the ship he is sailing, if it lists too much to the right, it will go under. Are you worried? Mr. McCluskey responded, I'm not worried at the moment, but of course we will review the situation. The leading ally to former leader Jeremy Corbyn said that Keir Starmer was in a great position to become prime minister, but only if he follows Mr. Corbyn's radical progressive agenda. The leader of the Unite Union, which is the UK and Ireland's biggest union, continued, he needs to listen to the left because without the left within our movement, then Keir will I'm afraid sail the ship onto the rocks. I don't think he'll do that, I think he's up for listening. When Ridge asked what would happen if Sir Keir abandoned Mr Corbyn's far-left policies, Mr McCluskey said bluntly, he will be in trouble. Labour's four-day annual conference, the first under his leadership, will all take place online. Sir Keir Starmer has also been warned against watering down the radical policies he promised during his campaign to become Labour leader by another trade union leader. The Fire Brigade's union told the BBC he must not cede any ground to the Conservatives and fight for root and branch reform of society. General Secretary Matt Rack added that he had not heard Keir make that case since becoming Labour leader in April. Sir Keir has urged the party and unions to stand together like never before.